Hi everybody, it's Julie and today is our mini challenge in the challenge. Do you have four envelopes? We're making a gift idea using four envelopes. I'm going to call it the Flippy Dippy. <laughs> it is a flip book with pocket. This is going to be our closure. So stay tuned. Let's go ahead and put it together. It's easy. It's fast. And you'll be able to use it as a gift. It's our gift component. Mini challenge in the challenge for the May Mayhem Mystery Junk Journal Challenge. So let's get started. Well, here I am. I have some envelopes. The first one I did, my envelopes measured six and a half by three and three quarters okay so my prototype was made with that these envelopes that i'm using this time are going to be seven and a half by four and seven eighths so um i think you're going to be able to do this with any set of envelopes um i do recommend that they have the uh, diamond shape opening like this because of the way that we are putting them together. Okay. So, um, for our first set, we are going to go ahead and take two envelopes and we want them to do this. So we are going to take this envelope and it is and this envelope, so two envelopes. And this top one that is on the left, we are gonna put the right side in and under into this envelope here, okay? So that is going, that is what that is, okay? Now we're gonna be um, gluing this right inside here. And you want to do it um, carefully because you don't want glue to go down inside. You just want it to be holding your pocket closed. And of course, we're going to have a glue um, problem here because, you know, it wouldn't be a Dear Julie Julie video without something going on with our glue. And so you can use any glue. So we'll pull out our liquid glue. I heard air, so we should be able to get into this one. Yay. Okay, and across, and across. Okay. Okay, now you do want it to line up with the outside of the other one, and across. Okay. So that is our first piece and we have a flap hanging off here and you're going to see we have made a pocket. So that is our first piece. Now for our second piece. Okay. So this, this right here is that. Okay. So that is that piece there and we have it made and ready. Okay. And so next, we need this part, okay? So for this, we are going to want one envelope with your flap out, okay? One envelope with your flap out, envelope flap out and we're going to take this envelope and we're going to come and open its flap okay and crease it over and we are we're going to go ahead and come down this edge right on the edge really really close to the edge okay and we're going to take that and we are going to put it, line it up with this. Okay, so turning it over. So we have 
our flap like this, okay? Now, you remember the one that we did before? And we have it glued down, okay? So it's glued. We're gonna bring this one over and this one's flap. We're gonna go ahead and pull it back on itself just like we did the other one. Okay, add our glue along the edge. Okay, glue along the edge and then turn it over. And if you pull this flap, you'll have a place to put that into. Okay, so um, during my Patreon's Q&A, they asked for ideas using envelopes. So here we go. We have an idea using four envelopes. And it's going, you're going to be able to make things out of this that are wonderful. Okay, so there's that. Okay, and it is attached here. Now you have these two pieces. Okay, flap and flap, or flip and flap. And we're going to just put a little bit of glue right here. Just a little bit. Just right on the tip. And pull that over. And there we go. We have a belly band okay Ta -da. okay so then there's that back okay so we have this we're gonna fold this over we're gonna come and fold this over Let's go ahead and give it a nice crease. And this is going to be our closure right here. Okay. So this is the base. We have a pocket here on the outside. And this opens like this. And this opens like this. Okay. So, and this opens like this. So... That is the base of your flippy dippy. We're going to call it a flippy dippy because it flips this way. You have a pocket over here. You have this opening. And you have <laughs> this opening. Okay? So, using items that you're using for your um, challenge... Um, also, with the mini challenge and the challenge, you don't have to be making the big challenge to participate. Um, but this is a requirement for the May Mystery Mayhem Junk Journal Challenge to make one of these. Okay, so make the base and then we're going to go ahead and decorate it. And so, um, while this is a mini challenge in the challenge, you can fill this using items from your list of 25 elements. Okay, so um, I think this is pretty exciting. So um, shall, we, shall we do it one more time? We can do it pretty quickly, I think, this time. Okay, so remember, we're going to have our two envelopes. We're going to take and have the one with the envelope on the right-hand side, the flap on the left. We're going to go ahead and put the other envelope in under the flap. And under the flap. So you could turn this into a Mother's Day card. You could um, have it be a graduation card. Hold a, It can hold a gift card. Um, maybe you have some great pictures of, you know, or for the teacher. You might have some great pictures from the school year. There's your pocket. And you can use that to, um, to, to, to add pictures 
for the teacher, gift card, other things. Okay, so for this side, um, we're going to put this on. And the flap is going to come over here, right? See, now I, I already forgot. Okay, so if it's on there. Yes, the flap comes over here. This is our closure flap. And so we bring in another envelope for this side. Go ahead and add glue onto the flap. So I think it's, I mean, it's pretty, pretty easy. Okay. And, well, let's do it this way. Put it down, line it up to the edge. I just wanna make sure I'm lined up so that you can fold it up. So now you can add, I'll show you here in just a second. Okay, so there's the first one. Now we have our, where'd it go? This is our other piece that we already made. So this one, we're gonna take that flap, okay? Whoop. And go along the edge. Flip it over, line it up. You can decorate this with beautiful digitals, scrapbook papers, a mixture of all. You can ink it. Okay, so then we need to come over and add our little bit of glue here. So, okay, so after we have fixed our belly band, we go ahead and flip these two pieces over and flip that one over and it closes like this. Okay, and you have that. Now, I'm going to go ahead and do just a couple more things. So I will be, um, I'm going to just do a small hole. Okay, but I'll be putting a hole here. Okay, and adding reinforcers and probably an eyelet. And then using this with my string can go around and that will keep this part closed also. Okay, so go around and, and then just um, tie it through. And so I'm thinking in here, we could go ahead and put a small journal. Let me just grab some papers from up here so I have this it needs to be a little smaller we are at the messy desk so yes welcome to the messy desk <laughs> I worked in the garden all weekend I am paying for it big time my back my back is in a very, very bad way today. Okay, so, so I have these papers and you know what? Let's go ahead, there's, there's this. If I, Put it right up along here. 
you know, look for some scrap paper that you have hanging around your hanging around your desk. So there's that. If I come down, I can cut it right along here. Did you see that quick bend and fold there? Yeah. Okay, and we'll fold this piece because you know we don't want any no waste. Okay, so there's that. You know, any papers that you have hanging around, go ahead and add them in. I'm going to add those so that they're like that, like this here. I would love to add, oh, I've got this. Okay, we're going to go, well, you know what, let's go ahead, we'll use this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, well, the bottom one I'm not going to trim. I'm going to go ahead and go across it. Okay, because this is just copy paper. And I'm going to, I'm going to flip this bottom up and give us a, um, a pocket. Okay. And I was thinking about not worrying about yeah we'll go ahead and we'll cut the top white line off okay um, you know what we don't need a pocket right Wait. Okay, we'll go ahead and flip it up. Okay, so it'll have a pocket. It'll be a nice pocket. And we need to cut. Give me, give me that. Okay, so this can literally be sewn in there and you'll have like a little mini journal on the inside of it if you wanted to do something like that. And it's, mine is a little big, so I'm gonna come, come along and chop some more off. <laughs> Okay, so I will probably go ahead and add that in there, like that, on that side. Okay, and then looking around, find something to go in, let's see, go this way. So some, find something for the belly band. So maybe a large tag could be made. Um, could use a whole guest check, I think, in the because of the size of this particular envelope. Okay, so something to go in there. Um, could maybe do a flip here, or maybe two pockets. Um, you know, there's lots of things that you can do there. Now for this page, you would have, you have this pocket. You can go ahead and cut along here and, th and this here and have like a diagonal. Oh, that's the one that's, sorry. That's the one that is, um, is glued. Okay, so not that one, but this one. You could go ahead and cut and have it be a tuck like this. So you'd have a pocket there and then cover this side. Um, I could have, you could do a border pocket here. Um, there's lots and lots of things, but this is our base and that's what I want you to make. And then I want you to fill it. Okay. 
So again, this is part of the May Mayhem Junk Journal Challenge. It is a requirement, but you get after you make your base, you get to fill it however you want, and you can actually use the some of the twenty five elements or embellishments that you have to make that maybe um, are going to make your journal too full. Because this time you just have to finish your journal. It does not have to, and you have to finish the 25 embellishments, the mystery mayhem embellishments, but they don't all have to go into your finished journal. So this would give you another place that you can add some of the items and it will make a great gift. So once it's finished, right? I think I'll probably make some of my embellishments from my list and add them here. And so watch for that. Details for the May Mayhem Mystery Junk Journal Challenge are in the description box down below. Watch that video. Follow the directions. Join us. It's a lot of fun. Don't forget we're here every day at 1030 Pacific Standard Time. And we'd love to have you join us in that live chat. Find something to celebrate every day. Have an amazing day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.